Hello everyone, welcome to the new video series of Azure DevOps. In this video series, we are going to see 30 videos in Azure DevOps in 30 days. What we are going to see now is how you can add a member to a team. So this is my project and I have a team where member needs to be added. So first of all, we need to add to the organization first, then we can add to the specific team. So currently I'm in my project. So if you just click on this Azure DevOps icon, it will get to you the organization and it will list out various project which is available in my organization. And here just go to organization setting and click on users. And here it will list out what are the users were already there in the organization. Now simply just click on add a user and provide the email ID over here. It's squealy and what kind of access you want to provide and here if you see basic stakeholder visual studio subscriber and one more licensing will be there which is basic plus test plan so what are this in azure devops access is managed by access level and security group so what you are seeing here these are the four access level where stakeholder is the least privileged access and it has very limited access let's say for example a person with stakeholder access cannot able to make changes in the backlog which means he cannot drag and drop he cannot change the priority of the work items the stakeholder can view delivery plan but may not be able to make changes and next level is visual studio subscriber if you are visual studio subscriber then you will be getting this license with this license you can have access to most of the features in azure devops a person with basic access level and contributor access at the security group will provide access to almost all the features in Azure DevOps but they may not be able to create test shoot, test plan, they may not be able to run test cases. If you wanted to do that then you need to buy basic plus test plan subscription. Now I am providing access level as basic and I am not uh, going to add under project which I will uh, do it separately and here if you see send email invites so it will send an email invite to the particular user. Now just click on add and yeah, Quilly got added. Now let's jump back to the organization and now we are getting into our project. So if you go to project and here if you see now it is project setting. Previously we uh, added in organization setting. Now just click on project setting. Under that go to teams and here it will list out all the teams which is available in the project. I need to add Quilly under dev team as yes, dev team now just click on add and now if you type you should be getting it just save it and that's it so quickly will be getting whatever the access which is provided to this particular team now let's add this team to the relevant security group to provide access so in order to do that go to permissions and here if you see these are the default security group access which is available and build administrator means this member can create modify and delete build pipelines and contributor so contributor also can uh, make changes or create pipelines or so everything they can do apart from this they will have complete access to release pipeline boards repository so they will have complete access so this is recommended for all the developers and project administrator so this is for the administrators and project valid user have very limited scope let's proceed to readers so readers will be having only read access so they can only read the boards they can only see what are the pipelines which are available what are the repositories which is available they but they cannot make changes in anything and release administrator is for the release pipeline they can perform all the operation in release pipelines now Let's provide contributor access to the, our team. So let me select this and go to members and let me add our team. And let's save it. Now all the members under this AS dev team will be having contributor access, which means Quilly also will be having contributor access. We have a lot of concepts to cover. I request you to hit the bell icon. Then only you will get a notification whenever I'm uploading new videos. I'll be providing the WhatsApp and Telegram channel URL in the video description. Please do join. Follow me on LinkedIn to stay connected. Thank you. Bye-bye.